tomorrow is the... Oh, actually, let's talk about mana. So, internet mana. Tomorrow is the big day for um, dot .com's announcement. What are we expecting from they, that? They need, a, the they need a big night tomorrow night because they're, they're tracking backwards, actually, in the polls. Mm. They're tracking backwards. They might have peaked too early. So, you know, it'll probably be something on key, you know, that there was something with regards to the spying. Will New Zealanders care? Dot com said during the week John Key could kill kittens in public and still go up in the polls. So I don't know if it's going to make a lot of difference. What do you think, Dion? And we've got uh, Glenn Greenwald, the Pulitzer Prize winning journalist, um, making an announcement tomorrow. He's already been talking mm. about some of his, um, his research in the last day or so. What impact do you think that will have? With those who are already sceptical, you know, those who are sceptical of government will um, yep. believe it 100%. Those who, uh, I don't think it will make that much of a change. Those people in the middle who were maybe sitting slightly on mm. the fence but tending towards Labour, it'll probably, might, might be the thing that pushes them over the, over the edge. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's, you know, it's, it's an interesting um, tactic, right? Uh, a week out from the election, um, obviously a bit of grandstanding and all that, but Again, it just sort of—it's another one of those tactics that goes to serve to undermine the um, the integrity of our our entire system, really. You know, uh, to point towards you know the, the big brother that's out there to to put out these assertions. And the thing is, you're never going to believe no no side's going to believe the other. You know, so if you're a citizen and you're always afraid of big government, you're going to think this is true. If you uh, um, you know if if you're an opponent of Kim dot com, you're going to think it's just grandstanding. So it's there's, there's really no way of finding out the truth in some ways. What are your thoughts, Tina? I mean, in a week where Intimana has had quite a lot of um, attention, perhaps not for, you know, the most positive reasons. I mean, tensions, there's been emails, there's been explosions, there's been a make-up as well. Do you think that this issue might be the silver bullet that might push them, give them a, a bit of a boost just ahead of the I'm election? Not, I'm not sure for Māori that uh, mm. are thinking about voting for uh, internet mana. Um, I don't know if this is going to deliver the game change because, uh, you know, as Willie said, uh, uh, .com has already been dampening expectations around that. In terms of the uh, internal ructions, you're, you're referring to the G Georgina Bayer uh, uh, issue. Um, well, she kind of raised, she kind of distanced herself at our uh, Te Tai Tonga debate for the EV Radio Network. Mm. Um, that was uh, over a month ago. Uh, that she um, she wasn't uh, feeling the love for for the internet for party com, or yeah. for dot com, mm. so um, you know they've they've not, this has been there for a wee while now. What about the Greens? What's going on with the Greens at the moment? <coughs> I mean, are they? Do you buy the notion that they could work with National after the election? <coughs> um, well, it's been ruled out, um, you know, by uh, by uh, the Prime Minister. But but here's the thing about the Greens. Um, I've, I've uh, been a fan of their campaign. I think it's been a positive <coughs> campaign. I think their billboards haven't been too busy. I think their billboards have... You know, who wouldn't agree with Love New Zealand? Mm. I mean, it's really clever. And I think Russell and Materia have an amazing job of not only holding their position, but growing. And, and I think being slapped down by Cunliffe uh, not going to be the Minister of Finance in any coalition deal. Um, the Māori Party. We're not going to have them in Cabinet, but we'll talk to them. Sure. You know, yeah. typical pa Labour... Patronising. Uh, patronising yeah. Māori, but also yeah. patronising the Last Green Party yeah. as well. And, I mean, at 23 or 24 or 25%, mm. you don't get to make those That's calls right. anymore. Yeah. You know, at 40%, 45%, sweet ass. OK, so we seem to have some agreement on that point.